Hey, welcome back, everybody. Today we are talking about the wipes that are happening for us, the note fix. I know it's been a long time coming. Horses, and also long time coming, and the skin sets that are coming in for this week for Rust Console Edition for the PlayStation 4, the Xbox One, next generations, and everything in between. And I'm Jade Monkey. All right, so the elephant in the room is the nodes and the note fix. Honestly, I didn't think we'd be going this long without them. Um, if anybody's been playing even semi-recently, you know what we're talking about. It's been pretty rough. I'm not saying you can't survive, but, like, game balance is definitely out of whack here. So it makes it very hard to come up on a server or even to bounce back when you have big groups camping these large node veins. Um, just know, it, just in case this goes on longer, fingers crossed, I hope it doesn't. Just know you can find these on the edge of monument cliffs, usually by the dish or in snow biomes. Basically, if the nodes aren't fixed, when you find big veins of these, make sure you mark them on your map and come back to them. They spawn in high density and often. It's definitely not the way it's intended. Um, so just know that, but I think it should be fixed by the time we have this wipe this week. Um, the good news is this fix is on PTB currently cooking, and it seems to be the fix for this. And I know it's been really hard to enjoy the new content that's come in when you basically can't even have a base long enough to survive. So, um, you know, be on the lookout for that. I know that's one uh, I, we've been playing during the node broken phase, and it's been rough. So I feel your pain. And also, we do know our next big content piece is going to be horses. So if historical data is to be believed from previous years, um, this is going to be sometime in July, unless they say otherwise. And again, this is on PTB testing or staging branch. This is a separate download. Some people are a little bit confused by that. You can upgrade your standard version uh, by buying, is it the Combat Cobalt Pack? Is that right? Something like that. Uh, either way, look inside the list. You'll see it says like PTB in the list and like some the Blackout skins and then some... Uh, extra coins and stuff. You'll find it in there. Most people should have it by now, but if you don't, that's how you find it. Um, we will have a new skin sets this week as well, so we're looking forward to that. Hopefully we get deployables. But currently, these skins here are repeats. This is the user-voted repeats. Um, so this is one of them. This is the Beach Blaster Arsenal. So if you like any of these, now's the time before Thursday. So if you guys want to go ahead and check that out. Also, um, I don't know if you guys knew this, but AIM Training is back on what is it, main branch. It was on main branch, then it went to testing, and now it's back on main branch. So it's called target practice. You can just type in target in the search, and you should be able to find it. There's also build servers. Also helps out quite a bit. Just saying, if you're looking for a good solo base, that's an absolute just face melter. I mean, it's just basically just solo. I do have the arrow base. I'll go ahead and link that now in the upper right-hand corner. If you want to go check that out. Uh, and it's a good place to actually test it out on the build server because there are a couple gotchas there, but it is extremely strong especially if you're rolling by yourself and it's nice and cheap. All right, on to the wipes for this week. So monthly main branch, June 29th, 2023. Thursday, we have a soft wipe. What does that mean? Well, that means you keep the blueprints and the map wipes. So you lose everything, but you keep the knowledge. And the servers come back online at 2.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, 11.30 a.m. PST, and 7.30 p.m. at BST. Now, 30 minutes before that, the servers go down. It takes them about 30 minutes to do the update. And hopefully these times are correct with uh, daylight savings time. Uh, usually around this time of year, I get one of these time zones out of whack. So just know around that time. Also around that time, we're going to get our um, skin updates for our skin sets as well. And again... I always give this advice and people are always coming back saying thank you for putting that out there because they tried it. If monthlies are getting stale, you have two really good options, right? Right now, before this wipe occurs, go shop another monthly server and get some BP stacked before the wipe, right? Or, uh, in this case, since we have a uh, like a full wipe over on uh, weeklies, what you can do is on Thursday, you can just go in there and hit the ground running. Dude, weeklies are full of action. And in most cases, Zergs won't mess with you unless you give them a reason. In most cases. I'm not saying there aren't Zergs and they're not going to attack you. They will. But Zergs have to worry about other Zergs or they're going to get smoked. So in most cases, weeklies are a bit more fast-paced and it keeps things a little bit more... What's the word? Fair, I think, for smaller groups or solos. So keep that in mind. It's a good time to shop around. All right, so on to weekly main branch, June 29th, 2023, Thursday. We have... Oops, I think I put it over here. Yes, I did. We have a full wipe, which is very exciting. And I, it, it, it's exciting, but I know towards, uh, like, if you've already been played out a little bit or you've been raided, you're kind of just waiting for the next wipe. So you can go around and do, like, target practice or check out some other service and just kind of mess around a little bit. 
um, it's a good time. Go on monthlies, give them, tell them, you know, what's up. Be like, hey, what's up, scrubs? It's a good time to go over there. Uh, anyway, so we have a full wipe. This is a um, BP wipe and also a map wipe. So you start from brand new, which is the best time to come in on a server. I'm telling you. And that occurs at 2.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, 11.30 a.m. PST, and 7.30 p.m. BST. Now, I know since the node fix is really kind of, uh, or the node situation and the node fix should be coming in, has made it very difficult uh, for people to really enjoy that new content. So I know a lot of people haven't even really messed around with the farming stuff yet. So I got your back. We have the Rust farm set up. If you're trying to get the hookups, you can also try this on the Builder's Paradise as well, as it does have monuments. So this should already be up on the end screen, and hopefully we see you in the next live stream slash video. Love you. Bye.